Hello viewers, today in this video we are going to create Apex chart. Let's begin how to do it. Let's create a page. What type of page? It is chart, uh, bar chart. Next, salary chart. Next, next. Location is local database and source is query okay now next orientation vertical label column department number and cell create Now let's run the page. You see it shows 10.88. These are the bar. This is a very simple chart. You see this is the department name. This is the department name. This is the department name. These are actually the in value in thousand. So let's discuss about the detail you see this is a region called salary chart and if you go to detailed its attributes is type bar it is vertical and uh, automatic and there's something like this here uh, and in the salary chart you have some details properties here most important thing is the series it is called series 1 let's rename it EMP cell its name is EMP cell and it's the, the query is the most important thing here you see this is the this is the query very simple query only only in one table okay now very important thing is column mapping label is mapped with department number and value is mapped with cell okay everything this is all you have to do nothing else you can uh, add something for titles for x column you may add department department and for y column you say value okay now save it and run it you see department is here and value is here now the beauty of this chart is you can add another series in the chart so let's create another chart or another series in the chart let's create a series you see on already um, you're here and no problem you have to make some modification here it's called EMP count it is based on the number of employees in a department uh, source is also query and you do not have the query here so we will count empno cmt its name is cmt okay it's done okay now there are some problem here you see the labeling label still is department number value is cnt now save it and run it you see this is the number of employees in the depart accounting department number of employees in the research department and number of employees in the sales department is six and this is the uh, total salary of this department 
total salary of the department total salary of the department now we want to add another query here okay now again create a series again u emp avg cell it is also query successful now okay now that you now there is some problem in the query let's name it avg cell avg cell okay it's validated okay now again labeling is to be here department and value is avg cell now save it and run it wow you see this is the salary value this is the number of employees and this is the average salary so accounting department earns the average salary of 2.9 and research 2.18 and sales 1.58 so this is a very simple but very powerful tool to create chart in apex so thank you for watching thank you everybody